Yo, what is up guys, it's Kobe back here with another Black Ops 2 tips and tricks video and today I felt like making another best class setup video. You guys seem to have enjoyed my first one and you guys were leaving some awesome class suggestions in the comments as well as a lot of other suggestions for future videos so thank you for all of those. But the two weapons that I saw standing out a lot were the FAL and the MSMC so today I decided I'd cover the FAL, share with you guys some tips on how to use it and of course my favorite classes that I personally like to use. And if you guys do enjoy the video and this series in general please remember to leave a like, I'd really appreciate it. So now with the foul, a lot of people consider this gun to be overpowered and I'm kind of on the fence about it because on one hand the gun is very very strong, up close and can kill in two bullets and that is just crazy, it's two bullet kill range is just insane and technically speaking it has the ability to kill 12 people with just one clip. Now on the other hand, because it is a single shot weapon, it does take a little more skill to use. You have to be a little more precise with your shots. You don't often see terrible players using this weapon because, you know, it does take a little more skill. But I do agree, if you are a fairly decent player, it's not that hard to abuse how good this weapon really is. But regardless, so far my favorite class setup with this weapon. For the perks, just a typical standard loadout toughness dexterity scavenger. You guys already know what those perks do for you. I don't think I really have to elaborate anymore. However, my perks do get changed up quite a bit. Pretty much only toughness and dexterity are perks that I will always use. So for attachments, I really like the basic red dot and stock. So red dot sights are really good on all single shot weapons. Really helps you keep your aim precise and on target. And stock, as you've seen in a past video, it's really helpful on assault rifles. You just move a little too slow while ADSing for my taste. But another attachment that I'll occasionally put on for this same loadout would be quick draw. Because for close range, this gun will actually win you a lot of gunfights simply because it only takes two shots to kill an enemy. So quick draw will help you a lot for aiming in because the hip fire spread is not all that great with this weapon. But again, I'll only throw on quick draw if I'm expecting to get in a lot of close range gunfights. Now I also do like having a secondary to swap to for close range encounters. The Cap 40 is definitely my favorite. It just shoots really fast and it kind of just complements the foul really well because of its fast fire rate and it also kills in three bullets close range too. So it's definitely a really good choice for a secondary. And the foul has a pretty large clip considering it's a single shot and it's high damage. You can easily kill multiple enemies with a single magazine and I pretty much never find myself in situations that fast mags would be necessary. I know a lot of people like fast mags but for me, for this weapon I don't really see the need for it. Now I don't really have a second class that I personally use for this weapon but I am thinking maybe some people don't have that great of a trigger finger or just want to see a select fire class. However, my one big tip if you are going to be using this gun is to not use select fire. And I have a couple reasons. So the first reason is that it doesn't even shoot that fast. It does shoot at nice consistent fire rate, but without select fire, you can definitely shoot it faster assuming you do have a decent trigger finger and you kind of shoot in rhythm with how it's supposed to shoot because you don't want to oversample it. If you oversample it, then it just kind of locks up and shoots slower. But if you get it in a nice rhythm, it shoots really, really fast. But the biggest reason is the recoil. Now without select fire, I can shoot as fast as I possibly can and there will be just almost no recoil. And if you use this weapon, I'm sure you agree with me that the recoil is just totally different from shooting normally and using select fire. So, you know, that's just my opinion. I'm not saying select fire is just completely awful because it's not. If you can't shoot it fast, it's an attachment that's worth considering most definitely. However, I think it's worth practicing not using select fire and just learning how to shoot fast because again, that's when you can use the weapon to full effect. So that's my class that I personally use and let me know what you think about it. What would you switch out to make it better to fit your playstyle more because everyone plays differently. You know, this class fits me really well, but that doesn't mean it will fit you. So remember to leave some class suggestions down in the comments. Help everyone out, especially if you have one with select fire. Like I said, I don't use it, but I'm sure someone here can benefit from seeing a good class. So leave one in the comments and we can all help each other out. And let me know what you think of this weapon in general, not just my class. Do you think it's overpowered or do you think, you know, kind of what I think that it's, if you know how to use it, it can be really good, but maybe for newer, less experienced players, it might take some time to get used to. Also, if you were looking for a select fire class, I am planning on doing a whole video that shows you guys some weapons that I do like using that attachment on, even some that you may not expect. So if you guys do want to see that video, make sure to let me know down below and I can definitely get that out for you guys. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did and want to support it, likes are always appreciated. Once it gets up to 300 likes, I'll start working on another video. And I've been getting out a video every other day recently and that's all because of you guys. So thank you for all that support. Check out the two videos on screen if you missed them and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.